many YouTube channels are there actually? 114 million, no. I'm not doing that many. I'll do three, maybe four. I'll do three and a half. Today, I'm drawing YouTubers as monsters. Keyword, today. Who knows what I'll draw YouTubers as next. <laughs> is one of my absolute favorite YouTubers, and she's very sweet and fun, so turning her into a monster was a bit of a challenge. But, as we all know, On every level except physical, I am a pumpkin. So I decided to turn her into a pumpkin lady. Large inspiration from her pumpkin lady video. I wanted to include both her iconic vintage style and her red hair, but that does bring up a weird question. Where does a pumpkin get hair? It's not like they naturally grow them, so, uh, maybe she stole it? She could have even made the wig herself. I gave her very long, spindly fingers to try and find this spooky and crafter. I guess she made her wig with her needle fingers. So there she is. watch all of them. Therefore, they count as the, the one and a half. But I adore Matt Pat and Steph, but the inspiration for this picture really came down to the fact that Steph is herself much of a chemist. And I was largely thinking of this video when I put together the idea of her being a mad scientist and Matt Pat more of the creation. My only regret with this picture is that I didn't include a spider because this moment lives rent free in my brain. Last but not least is Prickly Alpaca, Kira. I adore her videos, and as we all know, she does just so happen to live in that vampire realm. So I couldn't resist turning Kira into a vampire. However, I did decide that instead of going classic with the vampire fangs, I wanted to suggest it instead with the mask, kind of similar to this drawing she did on her channel. Initially, I was just imagining the mask to be something more of a cute party mask. But as I kind of look at it, the more I kind of imagine that this is what the skeleton of a vampire would actually look like. Instead of the two fangs, or four fangs, it'd be all of the two. Which does beg the question, is she wearing another vampire's face on her face? Because that is bold. Then I of course added on a corset and quite a lot of dress and sleeve. It just, it wasn't quite maximalist enough for me though, so I made it glittery. Don't judge me. I'm still who I am at my core, and I do love glitter. And that's that. These are the YouTubers as monsters that I chose to do for this week. Alright, I had a lot of fun doing this. <laughs> but even so, I left out so many YouTubers. Like Jazza, like Mararia. There's so many YouTubers. And honestly, tell me more. Give me more suggestions. I will watch them and I might just draw them. Speaking of suggestions, if you like this video, I have a couple more you might just like. We've got some fairy cats over here, we've got some rainbow witches over here, and I'm just happy to be here at all. Happy Halloween. <laughs>